Hey guys, it's Guy Cabbages, and today I'll be teaching you how to install Daisy for your computer. Alright, so first I'll show you how to do the manual method by actually going to their website, um, daisymod.com. I will include all links in the description to make it easier. Alright, so. 1.7.6 oh that was released yesterday I didn't realize okay so click on download and um okay so I recommend you download Daisy Commander it's much more simple than uh, play with six it's just for Daisy it's not for any other mods so it'll be easier okay so you download it just comes down download Daisy Commander now well, if you want, you can donate some money to them. Yeah. So just downloads. I've already downloaded it, so I'll cancel. And just install it like you would with any other program. Then after that, launch it. Might take a while to launch on the first time. But after that, it will be all fine. And as you can see, there's my Dota 2 background. I've been playing lots of that. I'll, I'll put up some videos on that too. Okay, so uh, opens up. There's like a whole list of servers. Now go to install slash update. It's the yellow thing up there. And uh, oh. okay, so yeah, these are all the maps. Okay, to install Daisy. Make sure this is up to date. If it says um out of date, then just it should say the latest build, and then click install, and it should install for you. And then after that, install DayZ. Mine's corrupt for some reason right now, but um yeah, you install it by clicking. Okay, that has repair, but then usually it should have install. So just do that. And then when it's done, uh, yeah, you've pretty much installed Daisy. Now you can go onto Daisy regular Daisy servers, and there's lots of filter options, or like ping the amount of players on the server. If it's a public hive or a private hive, I won't explain those today. But yeah, and you can launch windowed mode. Is you can set your own game launch options you can launch using steam okay okay that's the daisy commander way to do it and now I'll show it for those who have um, steam so just go to store this won't cost any money it's uh, completely free unless you haven't purchased armor 2 combined operations yet so okay if you haven't okay if you're completely new to this type in armor 2 Okay, whatever. Go to top sellers. It should be up here there, because lots of people have purchased this just for the mod. Okay, go on it. Buy it. The total download I think is around 15 gigabytes, which is a lot. Okay, so after that, after you've purchased and downloaded and everything, you have to launch Armor 2 uh, CO for the first time. So just to be sure, launch Armor 2 and then launch. Armor 2 Operation Arrowhead. Uh, yeah, should be all good. Then go to the store, type in Daisy. Armor 2 Daisy mod free. Go on that. And then this should come up. I've already got it, so it says play now. But if you don't have it, it, it usually has um, install game. Install it like any other game. It's around only. I think 100 MB. Let me check. Yeah, 169 MB. So it would be a pretty fast download if you have a decent connection. After that, you just run it. And then uh, it goes to the server browser. So I'll show you what it looks like in game. I'll use Commander since I'm not sure how to launch it in Windowed from Steam. But in the Daisy Commander, it shows you. Well, it has the launch options you can do. Ok, 
Okay, we're gonna wait for this. We'll be back when I launch into a server. Or not server, um, the game. Okay, so the thing was just Daisy Commander was just, uh, what do you call it, updating. Okay, now let's see. Oh, yeah, I have to repair it because apparently it's corrupt. Wait, let's just. I'll go on a New Zealand server since I live in Australia and that's the closest one without lag. Okay, so I'll just set that. Then the Z04, where's it? What version does it have? It doesn't tell me. And my thing just froze. Oh. Wait. Okay, wait. Um, I will. I will launch it from Steam, but I just gotta set some stuff with the recorder I'm using right now. We're back. Okay, so we're back, and I have launched uh, Daisy from Steam. I think it. Um, I think it updates itself automatically. Pretty sure it does. Okay, so. Let's run that. Okay, let's go to multiplayer. And then this is after we've installed everything and it's all working. Okay, so multiplayer. Um, here's a server list. Filters, pretty much the same as Daisy Commander. Okay, so that is. Alright, right. Okay, I've got to launch Daisy again from beta patch. Okay, I'll be right back again. Okay, so we. Okay, I launched it from the beta patch, and now I will connect to the server. Yeah. So you just find the server that you want. Like point NZ. Um. Yeah. Okay, I'll do NZ zero. Most of the servers in New Zealand have that in their name, so yeah. Okay, 27 in 06. Okay, we've got to join that. Now we just wait. Okay, so this is a server list of people. And then we connect. It might take a while. Yeah. Okay, so I have finally launched Daisy. This is what it looks like when you're in game. Uh, lagging a bit. I'm not sure what graphics settings I have this one right now. Yeah, so after you um, install it, join a server, wait for five minutes, and yeah, you're in Daisy. Go kill some zombies. My god, I'm lagging. Yeah. I've been playing before, so I'm already in this house. Usually, you just spawn around the coast. And, uh, if you want to quit, just click a bot, disconnect, and disconnect from the server. Should take you to the menu screen again. And yeah, you can do whatever you want from there. Okay, please leave a like, subscribe and comment. I will be making future videos on how to install the other maps of DayZ, like Linga or Taviana on the mouse. Okay, see ya. Okay, so we... Okay, I launched it from the beta patch. And now... I will connect to the server. Yeah. So you just find the server that you want. Like point NZ. Um, yeah. Okay, I'll do NZ zero. Most of the servers in New Zealand have that in their name. So yeah. 
Okay, 27 in 06. Okay, we gotta join that. Now we just wait. Okay, so this is a server list of the people. And then we connect. It might take a while. Okay, so I have finally launched DayZ. This is what it looks like when you're in game. Uh, lagging a bit. I'm not sure what graphics settings I have this one right now. Yeah, so after you um, install it, join a server, wait for five minutes, and yeah, uh, you're in DayZ. To kill some zombies. My god, I'm lagging. Yeah. I've been playing before, so I'm already in this house. Usually, you just spawn around the coast. And, uh, if you want to quit, just click a bot, disconnect, and disconnect from the server. It should take you to the menu screen again. And yeah, you can do whatever you want from there. Okay, please leave a like, subscribe and comment. I will be making future videos on how to install the other maps of DayZ, like Linga or Taviana on the mouse. Okay, see ya. Okay, so I have finally launched DayZ. This is what it looks like when you're in-game. Uh, lagging a bit. I'm not sure what graphics settings I have this one right now. Yeah, so after you um, install it, join a server, wait for five minutes, and yeah, you're in Daisy. Go kill some zombies. My god, I'm lagging. I've been playing before, so I'm already in this house. Usually, you just spawn around the coast. And, uh, if you want to quit, just click a bot, disconnect, and disconnect from the server. It should take you to the menu screen again, and yeah, you can do whatever you want from there. Okay, please leave a like, subscribe, and comment. I will be making future videos on how to install the other maps of DayZ like Linga or Taviana on the mouse in case yeah.